The National Association of Nigerian Students says it will not participate in a planned protest scheduled for the 1st to 10th of August. The student body made its position clear during a meeting with the Minister of Education and the Senior Special Assistant to the President on Students' Engagement in Abuja. Helen Osamedekins reports. Nigerian youth announced plans to organize a nationwide protest to address economic hardship and governance issues set to take place from August 1st to August 10th, 2024. First Nigeria student. Yes. There have been calls from different quarters of the country appealing to the youth to shun the planned protest and be patient with this administration. The Minister of Education is not left out in the plea. In this meeting with the student's body, he highlights some of the achievements of his boss and why the students should be patient. Than what we want to do. So your voice is very strong to appeal to uh, your generation for them to understand that, look, uh, what is needed is for them to continue to yes, raise those voices and then the government will listen to them and continue to address all those concerns. Nobody is saying that his voice will be shut down. No. NAS representative acknowledged the efforts of President Tunubu's administration in the education sector and promised to give its support for the government. We are aware of the good initiative initiated by President Tunubu in the education sector and the one that is very important to us is the student loan. Here our students can access loan, finish their educational pursuit. We are grateful for that. Students, as we have resolved to be law-abiding, not to cause chaos in our society or not to join those who want to cause chaos in our society. I to the president to put mechanisms in place to alleviate poverty among Nigerian students as a result of hardship occasioned by removal of fair subsidy in 2023. To plead with the Honorable Minister and the SSA, we, the student constituency is a special constituency and they are the largest youth in the country. As they are distributing palliative, the student constituency should be put into consideration too because the hunger is telling on us seriously. The meeting also avails the student representatives' opportunity to bring before the minister issues affecting their students and their institutions. Helen Osamede Akins, TVC News, Abuja.